Welcome back to Loving Living Local. We are proud to be a partner and a sponsor for Club 365, the fundraiser for the Shreveport Regional Arts Council. And today we're actually with another partner with Michael Butterman, the conductor for the Shreveport Symphony Orchestra. Thanks for joining us today. My pleasure. Good to be with you. So you guys have a really cool thing. You guys have partnered with Club 365 and Shrek as well. Right. So we're honored to be uh, partners with uh, this uh, fantastic project. And we are offering two different packages, actually two sets of, or pairs rather, of uh, Create Your Own, we call them, uh, subscriptions for our 21-22 season. That would be five concerts each, uh, again, for two people. And uh, in each of those two packages, uh, there is a dinner at Chianti that goes along with that. And one of those packages also includes a limo ride uh, to the concert. So kind of a, a way to treat yourself uh, and have a real special kind of night out. Absolutely, dinner and a show. That's it, exactly right. We're all looking forward to being able to, yes. to have those dinners and, and, and go to those shows in person, which we certainly expect to be able to do uh, coming up next season. Yeah, and that's one of the wonderful things about the Shreveport Symphony Orchestra. You guys perform so many different varieties of music. That's for sure, yeah. We have uh, a, certainly what we call a pop series. We also have uh, a, a, an annual rock show uh, that uh, we've been uh, presenting for a number of years now, which really gets us in front of a, a very wide spectrum of, of our uh, population. We also do tremendous work uh, in the schools and uh, f with our libraries here. Uh, so there's, a, there's a, so much that goes on that the Shreveport Symphony um, you know, uh, provides to this community that just really is beyond those concerts that we, uh, that we have down at the Riverview Theater. Yeah, absolutely. And I know that right now, while we can't actually attend concerts in person, you guys have been doing some different things to keep the music and to keep the spirit alive. Yes, exactly. We've had a couple of televised productions for one thing, but uh, we are right now while we're in phase, what are we in, phase two, right? Two, two and a half, I'm not <laughs> exactly. sure at this point. <laughs> Uh, we can't have live audiences at our concerts, but we are getting uh, the musicians together. In fact, this weekend we have a um, concert, uh, and those are being live streamed, uh, and then they are available on demand for viewing for a period of uh, two weeks. So we're really able to present essentially the same kinds of concerts and the same number of concerts that we have in the past. It's just that the experience of going to it is a little different. You're in your uh, living room uh, watching on, you know, let's say, a television or a computer. Um, and you know, that has some advantages, of course, as, uh, as well as a few drawbacks. But uh, it's really been a, a, a important for us to be able to keep the music playing during this time. I think music is such a, uh, uh, it's just a, <laughs> it, it's a kind of catharsis for uh, for people. We, we experience things through through the arts and through music in particular uh, that um, that are important for our, our spiritual well-being and, and especially right now I think that's uh, a real high priority for everyone. Absolutely. Perfectly said. Well, thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you for letting us come hang out with you and um, we are so excited that this is going to be one of the fabulous things you can win. My pleasure. We're excited about it too. Looking forward to it. Well, guys, if you want a chance to win this, you need to go to joinclub365.com right now. Become a member and you have a chance to win. And of course, tune into Loving Living Local for chances to win prizes and find out if you're a winner.